unicorn! At last! It's mine! Do you propose to steal it? Ben Salad! I know about you. I've seen under the palace. You're an imposter. You call yourself a merchant, but you're a merchant of death. And what are you? A sneak thief who has broken into my private home pretending to be a journalist. I'd have said we were very much the same. We're a world apart. But we're after the same thing. Ouch! Snowy! It's me, Tintin! <laughs> you see, even your dog cannot tell the difference. Huh? Hello again, matey. Now, why don't you hand over those scrolls? <laughs> I've ordered me a big shot. <coughs> I recognize the sound of that voice. I must be getting near. Ugh. Gosh, there are a lot of creepy crawlies in these hot countries. Thank heavens! 
I mean, thank heavens you're safe and sound. Oh, do you hear that? My public calls. I'll be back in an instant. Don't you dare move. <laughs> Tintin, that was a nightmare. Let's get out of here, quickly. I have all three scrolls, Captain. Look. Blistering barnacles.
give me my dear old Tom. Forgive me. That. Good for nothing, mangy old car. No, no, you just said we'll follow you. All the way to your accursed island in Brittany. That's it. That's where we need to look. In Brittany. In France. What do you mean? Where's that? Northern France. It must be your ancestor's hideout. An island or a cave. Around here. Are you ready to follow in his footsteps, Captain? Turns out your ancestor wasn't such a coward after all. Set a course for Brittany, Tintin.
Captain! We're not going to be driving with this all the way to...